There are a ton of AI presentation tools in the market today. Which one should you choose? To answer that, we need to know what to look for in an AI presentation tool in the first place. That is what we will cover today in this video. I'll also share my recommendation. So watch this video till the end. It will clear a lot of confusion you might have regarding selection of AI presentation tools. I'm Ram Gopal from presentationprocess.com. We help professionals like you create engaging presentations. Let me start by sharing a simple framework that I've developed to help us understand how to select the right AI presentation tool based on the kind of presentations we make. You see, not all presentations serve the same purpose. Based on the stakes involved, they can be broadly classified into low stakes and high stakes presentations. Low stakes presentations include things like junior school projects or hobby related talks. The audience here is usually looking for a basic understanding of the topic. They don't expect deep insights or detailed analysis. If we plot the presentations by the depth of insights they require, successful low stakes presentations that match the expectations of the audience sit here. High stakes presentations, on the other hand, are professional by nature. For example, they could be pitch decks, market analysis reports, medical presentations, etc. In these cases, the audience is not listening for just awareness. They expect actionable insights. They want reliable data, sound analysis, and clear recommendations they can use to make real decisions. Successful high stakes presentations that match the audience's needs sit here. Now, the truth is, most AI presentation tools available today, like Microsoft Copilot or Gamma, are designed for low stakes presentations. You type in a prompt, and within seconds, they churn out a presentation shaped thing with a decent layout and a few stock photos. But Beyond the surface polish, most of these presentations don't have much substance. In my view, most AI presentation tools are a little more than formatting machines that package generic summaries in a neat layout. The real problem shows up when people try to use them for high stakes presentations where surface level slides don't work. Let me give you an example of what these tools produce. The topic of the presentation is Tesla Cybertruck Competitive Landscape Analysis. This is the prompt. As you can see, the prompt is detailed and thorough. There are clear instructions about what it should include and what it should not include. There are instructions for visualization, the core elements of the report. Everything has been well thought out. So I'm going to copy this prompt and use Microsoft Copilot to see what kind of result it produces. So let us go to a new presentation, say create a new presentation. I'm going to stick the prompt here by pressing Ctrl V and now say enter. Here is the finished slide deck. Let me read the content of one of the slides. The slide is about current market size, segmentation and growth drivers. For market size analysis, it has one sentence to produce that too is very generic. For market segmentation, another sentence. Now look at the kind of pictures used. You can't get any more generic than the picture of a tire, someone drawing something and there is a truck behind. I don't even know what this picture of a shopping cart is doing inside Tesla's competitive landscape analysis. So clearly, neither the quality of the slides nor the pictures used are up to the mark. So that is the reason why most of these common AI presentation tools end up disappointing the presenters when it comes to high stakes presentations. So what is the solution? It's obvious. Use the right tool for the right job. When I make high stakes presentations, I need research grade accuracy. I don't want a tool that instantly spits out some generic slides. I need the tool to first do a deep dive into sources, fact check, pull resources, and then structure the content into a presentation. The one tool that ticks all the boxes is the one that I discovered recently called skywork.ai. In case you are new to the tool, Skywork Super Agents is the world's first AI workspace suite built on deep research powered by Skywork's proprietary LLMs. Skywork Super Agents can generate documents, slides, sheets, web pages, and podcasts from a single prompt. All right, now watch the difference. This is the exact same prompt that I showed you earlier, which I fed into Microsoft Copilot. Skywork did its magic, and this is the result. Let's look at the presentation. Right off the gate, look at the kind of pictures used. Very relevant to the presentation. Look at the slides used. These are real data. How do I know? When I go back to this view, when I click on these dots, I can clearly see where the source of this data comes from. 
you can click on any of these and you can click on the link as well and that takes you to the original source. Now as a presenter, imagine the kind of confidence you will have when you stand behind these slides in a boardroom. Absolutely every single point can be defended. Now look at the depth of each of the slides. The topic, the kind of information covered and the kind of details shown. So this is the difference between the slides generated by the usual AI presentation tools and the one generated by skywork.ai. Be it the quality of slides or the kind of pictures used, the charts used, the diagrams used, everything is on point. So how is Skywork able to achieve this level of accuracy? The secret lies here. As I go through the complete presentation generation process, I can see how many sites have been referred to and how much information has been analyzed and the result obviously is of a very high class. For your information, skywork.ai surfaces 10 times more source material than comparative tools like Genspark or Manus for the same prompt. Can you now see why I prefer skywork.ai over any of the generic AI presentation tools? Now you might say, Ram, I'm not some fancy prompt engineer to write these kind of elaborate prompts. So will Skywork be suited for me? Good, you asked. Skywork.ai is built for everyday presenters like you and me who need to create professional grade presentations. Now what makes it different is the tool actively nudges you to provide the right details so it can deliver the exact output you're looking for. This happens through a clever feature called clarification card. Let me show you. I asked Skywork to create a marketing presentation to showcase the natural wonders and outdoor adventures of Japan. The presentation generation started and almost right around the start, Skywork presented this questionnaire. This is the clarification card. Skywork asked me some very important questions that I had not thought before. For example, I was asked, which natural features would you like to focus on? And there were quite a few options here. I chose coasts and islands. And then I was given the next question, which is which outdoor activities would you like to highlight? I chose hiking and trekking and cycling. And then the next question was asked, which is who is the target audience for this marketing presentation? I chose international tourists. You see, I may not have started with a perfectly clear prompt, but the clarification card feature of Skywork has guided me along the way to refine the prompt till I got the exact output I needed. And not only this, Skywork even gives me an option to determine the look and feel of the output. For example, since my presentation is about natural wonders and outdoor adventures of Japan, I don't want the output to look like a business report. I want it to look like a travel guide. So when I click on this option here called templates, I can see a whole bunch of options I can select from. I chose the option of travel guide and I hit enter. And to take this experience one notch up, Skywork asked me if I wanted to use professional data for my presentation. As you can see, these are real-time updates and therefore the data actually costs, which means you need VIP access to access professional data. But if you're making a key presentation where professional data is essential, then you have the option to use it right inside skywork.ai. And of course, there are other benefits that you get as a VIP member. For example, you get even more options for templates that allow you to choose the exact look and feel for your presentation. And if that is not enough, as a VIP member, you get to add your own template with your own brand guidelines. So the output generated by skywork.ai is visually consistent with the rest of the company presentations. That's a great way to maintain brand consistency. Though I didn't use the VIP option, the output generated was top notch. Look at the opening slide here with a video background. The information was neatly organized and completely thorough. And the best part is the pictures were very specific and the information was actionable. For example, when I take a look at the iconic routes of cycling in Japan, I not only got the name of the different adventure routes, but also the distance and even a bar chart that compared the route lengths in kilometers. Now compare this to the generic information I got from Microsoft Copilot. And look at this attention to detail. Since it's a marketing presentation, there needs to be a call to action in the last slide. And you can see it says, plan your Japanese adventure today. And there is this button that takes me to the contact us page. Everything was spot on. As you can see, skywork.ai gives you far more than any of the generic AI presentation tools available in the market. Now, the obvious next question is, Ram, it is clearly evident that for high stakes presentations where there is a need for deep research, skywork.ai is the perfect choice. 
But what about presentations where I don't need deep research? Can Skywork help me get something quick and effective? The answer is yes. Skywork has this useful feature called Fast Mode, which is meant for efficient presentation creation with simplified steps, ideal for urgent business needs with clear goals. So if you need to create quick presentations for your business, where you are clear about the objectives of your presentation, then skywork.ai can give you much better results than any of the generic presentation tools that you see in the market. For example, I asked Skywork to create a presentation about natural wonders and outdoor activities in Japan in the fast mode. Now look at the output here. It looks much better than the output created by the usual AI presentation tools. The pictures are still relevant, the data is still on point, and therefore you can use fast mode in case you want quick presentations of high standard. And naturally, fast mode doesn't take up a lot of credit points. And there is an interesting option available in Skywork that helps me to manage my credits smartly. I can write my prompt and can get a quick estimation of the number of credits it would take for me to complete the presentation. So I can make my decision in an informed way. So as you can see, Skywork can help you create high stakes presentations with deep research and also quick presentations using fast mode. The natural next question is, can Skywork help you create a presentation when you upload your own documents? The answer is yes. I found this academic paper on the net and I wanted Skywork to create a presentation based on this document. I went to the knowledge base option in Skywork, uploaded the PDF file, and gave a prompt asking Skywork to generate a presentation based on the uploaded PDF file. Skywork parsed the knowledge base file, went through the content, designed the outline, and finally created the presentation. And this was the output. The slides looked thorough. All the pieces of information have been nicely summarized. All the essential details have been covered. The visuals used are on point. And you can see it is much easier to go through this presentation than to go through that dry report which was full of text. And the thing is, if I don't like any part of the text here, I can edit it quite nicely as I would do with Google Slides. I can click on edit and that opens up this option here. I can select anything and I can make my changes here. Let us say instead of the word way, I choose to write path and I can save and the presentation is saved. Every change is saved as a separate version. So if at any point I don't like the change I made, I can go back to the previous versions and recover my original material. Another interesting thing is Skywork makes it easy to collaborate with your colleagues and your bosses. You just click here and you can share this file. You can share it using any of these options or you can go for copy link and the link expiry can even be determined, let us say for three days, seven days, etc. So if you work in a company where your presentation requires inputs from multiple people, from multiple departments and approvals from different people, then instead of relying on long email threads, you can use the collaboration features of Skywork. And let us say your boss suggests some change in slide number three, you can regenerate that specific page. So you can click on this and only that page gets regenerated. So the rest of the presentation remains and the flow is maintained. And once I'm happy with my final presentation, I can download the presentation and I have options to download it as Google Slides, PPTX, PDF or HTML. So in short, no matter who you are, whether you are a teacher, a student, a businessman, a CEO, it doesn't matter. No matter what kind of presentations you make, Skywork can help you create top quality presentations quickly and effectively. So click on the link in the description box below the video and give skywork.ai a try and see how the tool can help you create better slides than most of the generic AI presentation tools that are available in the market. We sincerely thank skywork.ai for sponsoring this video. If you like this video, give this video a like. If you want to see a comparison of skywork.ai with Microsoft Copilot and Gamma, I'm giving you a link right now on your screen. Click on the link and watch that video I created earlier. It is an interesting watch. I'll see you inside that video next.